Hello everybody, welcome to Andrew's Reviews. It is Friday, it is. Fun Friday, fun Friday, fun Friday. It's fun Friday, but it's an early fun Friday. Day off today for me, so actually my fun Friday started uh, last night. Um, and yes, we're heading off to Edinburgh this weekend. A long weekend in Edinburgh coming back Monday. Um, and so yeah, just get this out of the way because I don't know when I'm going to uh, be able to re record a video. Might be an opportunity on the train on the way up, which might be an interesting one. So uh, stay tuned for that one. Um, so this is the beer um, I'm reviewing, and I decided on this midweek. This is from Harveston Brewery. It's their Shihalian uh, Craft Lager, coming at 4.8% ABV. And decided on this because I saw in the news uh, this week that the um, the 40, they they're celebrating their 40th birthday round about now. So just as a, a bit of congratulations to those guys, and uh, it's a craft lager, and you don't get many craft lager, good craft lagers out there. I thought it was be a, make a good fun Friday drink. And it's four point eight percent ABV. Oh, some nice aromas. But it's four point eight percent ABV, so nothing too heavy before my trip up north. Um, let's get poured out, shall we? Into a glass. It is a pilsner. So I've been going since eighty three. 83 which is some going really and this is one of those breweries started off in somebody's shed and is one of the better um, brewers uh, north of the border so lager in a glass very clear dark golden color golden color it's a dark gold I'm, I'm not gonna go no I'm gonna go it's just a golden color uh, lots of uh, beautiful carbonation and a lovely white head. Looks good. Let's get a sniff, shall we? Yeah, got that bready mole on opening it. Bready mole, a little bit fruity. I think I'm picking up a little bit of citrus and maybe a bit of spices in there. But yeah, certainly the bready malt. Certainly a fruity that's coming through on that. Right. Um, looks good. Smells good. Let's taste show Cheers, everybody. That is a good craft lager. Um, had a few of these beers from these guys. Um, my wife's nephew uh, lives in Scotland. To be fair, this could well have come off him. So, cheers, Andrew. Really, really full flavour. Um, it is fruity. There is a lovely pithy grapefruit note coming through. Starts off the back of the throat quite pithy, but it just spreads across the mouth as lovely, juicy um, grapefruit. There's a hint of lemon in there. Hint of floral. It's all about the hops. Not getting much. There's a sweetness coming through, which will be coming from the, the malts, but that's all the malts provided in this one. On the flavour. On the back end, actually, on the back end I'm getting lovely pithy zesty bitterness but that mellows out and that grapefruit comes through again. But for a minute it was just a 
bready, sweet bready malt flavour coming through, but no, there's, there's the, um, the grapefruit in there. That is a good beer. It's got a nice, gentle sweetness. It is, I mean, the, it is really smooth. The um, head retention on that is really good. And it is really refreshing. That is a good craft lager. Um, people say some nice things about it, I can see why. Yeah, I like that a lot. I like that enough to score that. 8.5 out of 10. 8.5 out of 10 from Men's Beer Views that we are drinking. Probably not now. What are you drinking tonight? Please enjoy it. Uh, comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff until the next review. Cheers, everybody.